homophobic, uh, you're a bigot, you're racist. And that's the craziness that's going on in the world right now. Well, a lot of the Black Lives Matter groups are getting more intense. They're not apologizing for saying F. Paris. They're saying these are white people. They deserve it. Yeah, that's disgusting. I mean, I number one, the guy, DeRay McKesson, I can't stand that guy. Uh, he's a worthless person and the so-called leader of Black Lives Matter. You know, there are a few people in that movement, I think, that have a, a pure heart who really want to make some kind of change. But that, that entire movement has been hijacked. Uh, it's sure, nothing and, more and, than and, and a lot of the low-level people are just thugs and criminals or folks that are upset and angry. And they're being manipulated by the mainstream media that legitimizes all of this. It's disgusting how you can compare a massacre to a poop swastika on a wall. Uh, really, that, that, that brought you the pain of losing family members, loved ones, friends that'll never come home. Friends that you thought you would see after a concert, but it'll never come back again. You know, so many people wanting that they wishing they had that last chance to say final words. But these people are complaining and whining because of something drawn on a wall. The definition is spoiled something. rotten babies when they when they complain. We're not and, getting and attention. It's not, just, it's not just at Mizzou. Go to University of Texas. Go to all of these colleges around the world. It is ridiculous what is being taught much less the, the brainwashing going on and the fact that these people are not smart enough to see past that propaganda and come out with a clear, precise thought on really what's going on. They can't see past it. Brain force is here. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been on this the last few months. You probably noticed I've been more crazed, more focused, less brain fog, more energy, more special reports, and it's because of brain force. One of the worst things with most energy products is it's not sustainable, right? You're going to crash and going to feel really bad afterwards. This has a bunch of different antioxidants and compounds and polyphenols. Everybody's on these drugs to knock their brain out because the brain's so fried. We kept changing this formula over and over and over again until it became sort of a grand puzzle. For example, the L-theanine inside of it, that is activated by the different compounds in the yerba mate that we put inside of it as well. This just increases the compounds you already have. This is what you're actually designed to run on. Exactly. It's kind of like a car will run on one form of junkie gas, but it runs really good on what it's designed for. You will find Brain Force, Survival Shield X2, and other game-changing products at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life Vitamin B12 formulation. Most forms of vitamin B12 are highly processed and synthetic and could not be properly absorbed by the body. That's why for real results, so many are having to turn to painful B12 injections, which are known to have higher absorption rates. Now, InfoWarsLife.com is excited to announce that we can bring you our most bioactive, powerful form of B12 that has been developed with our exclusive perfected process. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12, methylcobalamin, the same kind used in B12 injections, and adenosylcobalamin. Secret 12 is simply taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Don't take my word for it. Try it for yourself. Discover the secret. Secret 12. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. I have never had a deer in the headlights experience this crazy because I'm not really a fan of like rock stars, movie stars, people like that. I like politics. And I'm sitting there during that 70 second break, and Matt Drudge rounds the corner over here. Uh, and it was just like total and complete deer in the headlights. And I'm still double taking here. And then he's hiding over there in the shadows right now. I'm not kidding. They're going to say this is another conspiracy theory. And, uh, we got Anthony Gucciardi. Is Matt Drudge over there? He is over there. Come on, just for a second to give the national media a heart attack. Can you just walk over here behind the stage? They're not going to believe it. Now, nope, see, it's, it's, yeah, it's right around this way. I haven't had one photo in eight years. I know you haven't had one photo in eight years. All right, I'm going to turn the mic your way. Maybe. They can do voice print. Is this Matt Drudge? Uh-oh. I know. Okay, it's made up. It's a stunt. April Fool's came early. What, how many months early? Five months early? April Fool's, folks, I, I fooled you. Well, am I supposed to go to rebroadcast now that you're here? Because, I mean, I, you get to hang out with my crew and I'm on the air. This is, like, diabolical. Oh, my gosh. Anyways, no, seriously. 
do you think folks are going to believe Matt Drudge was here? Probably. I don't even believe he's here. I didn't believe it. Only because it's like it was like such short notice. It was like, boom. I remember years ago. Well, anyways, I'm not going to get into it. This is this is crazy. All right. Well, I'm not going to be aggressive and turn the lights on over there and aim the document cam over there. But Matt Drudge came in, said hi to me, thought it was a three minute break and then went over there. I'm definitely going to have to uh, play a clip or something. Do we have one of those special reports coming back from the next break? All right, this is this is now entered complete twilight zone. Um, hey, but we got a new article up on Infowars. Obama arms ISIS militants, pushes gun control on very same day. Obama authorizes uh, resupplying Syrian opposition on same day he demands gun control against American citizens. And of course, I was covering this Breitbart article a lot that I missed. I missed stuff all the time. I mean, I, I knew they were doing this, but I didn't know they were actually d openly doing it. Obama administration and U.N. announced global police force to fight extremism in U.S. And then we've got all these callers that want to talk to me. You know, Matt has hosted the, the Drudge Report uh, uh, show for so long, but also Rush Limbaugh. So I, I would imagine he could come over here and actually host the show for us, except he's not really here. What if we put a microphone into the darkness coming out of the break and, the, and folks can do a voice print analysis to see if it's Matt Drudge? He's not going to do it? I'm telling you, this is so classically reclusive. I wish I could do that. He is back there right now. It's taken a lot of work to get to this point. I know it's taken a lot of work to get to this point. I, I admire you. Maybe I should become reclusive. Huh? He's a big guy. Uh, in good shape, too. I was like, man, who is that big guy? Who is that? I recognize that guy. Who's that with him? I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> what did I look like, Buckley, when he walked in? I mean, I literally was like, who is that? You are something else, man. God, I tell you, he's got a lot of, he's got a lot of class the way he pulls stuff off. I'm kind of the opposite, like a bull in a china shop, a loose cannon. Uh, anyways, I was already super wound up today. I've already had too many DNA forces today, and uh, this is now just pushing me over the edge. I need some Jack Daniels Buckley immediately. <laughs> I'm sure. I've, I've, I've not been drinking since last Thursday. I've been being a good boy. And uh, I've been being nice, but I tell you, I may have to, I, see, I, I, I don't have any, um, what do you call them, tranquilizers. But I think I need a tranquilizer dart or something. All right, folks, we'll be right back. No, no, seriously, because I'm starstruck right now. This is crazy. And the way he did it is even worse. And then it's going to be even worse when they have, like, some major establishment White House-driven publication saying I made it all up. So we at least, well, we can't get a photo for Twitter. What are we going to do? The suspense is deafening. DrudgeReport.com, you can uh, read up there where this guy put stuff on his Facebook, the supposed shooter, uh, about how he just had so many pills he was on, psychotropics, lithium, uh, and other things, that he ended up just taking five at a time. So the question is, was he on meds? And the answer is, uh, does a bear, you know, do different things like jump rope in the woods? We'll be right back. All right, folks, Alex Jones here back live well into the third hour. I did not do this as a stunt. Neither did Matt Drudge. He is here. We got a hot mic over there. He wants to stay literally in the shadows behind a curtain. Uh, but this is the king of being able to push a story out and make it the number one story in the world. They even admit that in the New York Times that he has more readers on politics and news than Facebook, the New York Times, and the Washington Post, L.A. Times put together. He's got some of our stories uh, where the shooter himself said he was on a bunch of drugs. Uh, he's linked to that today, and that's the story they don't want out there, or the story where CNN took a mixed racial Christian hater and turned him into a right-wing white supremacist and turned him white. They don't want people knowing that, but Matt Drudge and his great crew can link to alternative stories, foreign stories, mainstream stories, photos, mug shots, and really just focus on what Matt Drudge thinks is interesting, and the public tends to agree with him that what he focuses in on is really catching the zeitgeist are the pulse of the people. So he might have 50 links every day where Facebook has 500 million, but he has more traffic. That is the true David versus Goliath story. And this is not scripted. I have no idea where I should go. Uh, Matt Drudge, I, I guess you're here for ACL or why are you in Austin, Texas? <laughs> Well, you were just talking about Facebook, and thanks again for having me here. Um, I'm not on Facebook. Um, I don't do the socials. I've got that little Twitter thing. Even that's kind of disgusting. 
You know, I've been doing the internet as long as you've been doing this radio show, Alex, literally every day as you have literally every day, practically. I think you've taken a little more time off than I have, actually. Yes, I've kind of gone. And I can't say that about many people because you are a peer without peer. And I'll tell you, I was there before Facebook. I was there for, before CNN.com. I was there before mostly all of them. I have a very clear perception what the internet is in my mind. I'm free. I'm not defined by what they say the internet is. Uh, meaning Goldman Sachs, meaning who they invest in for the latest startup, meaning the latest BuzzFeed or Salon or Gawker. All, well, Gawker's more independent. But there's a lot of corporate makeover of the internet that I have not adapted to. Simply put, uh, I'm friends with some of them. When I go to New York, I make the Sixth Avenue rounds, but I am not a part of that system. I am a free thinker. I'm an American. I'm very concerned with what's happening. So I just give it my all. I've learned how to take care of myself and detach from outcomes because otherwise you can't survive. And I don't know where you are on that topic. That's I just follow my instinct because they always tell us how to adapt to be successful, but really we're just adapting to their mindset to I be don't. their slaves. I don't. No, you don't. I have remained completely independent from all of them. All of them. I am not influenced by any of them. I need no traffic from Google. I don't care if I get one traffic refer referral from Google or Bing or Yahoo or any of these others. It's always been that way. Now, if you think of that setup, how rare that is, because everybody is so hungry for referrals, for likes, I don't need to be liked. I don't need to be liked at all. I don't care if there's a button right there at the top of Drudge saying like or dislike. Thumbs up, thumbs down. doesn't mean anything. Now... I hope that you come doesn't mean you necessarily have to like what I have up there. Now, where I've had a lot of success is I'm getting people from both sides of the aisle. They've always said, always oh, a right wing gossip monger, mainly because of Lewinsky in those years, which by the way are back. Why aren't we seeing Hillary's lovers? Excuse me. Why aren't we seeing Hillary's lovers? It's a good question. Where's the cover up on this? So many issues that are suppressed on a daily basis. So that's what I try to do every morning. Incredible. Well, it's amazing to have you here in Austin, Texas. And I tell you, you certainly know how to make an entrance. I'm in a 70-second break, and I turn around, and there's Matt Drudge just boom. <laughs> I tell you, I almost had a heart attack, a good one. <laughs> My cousin said he's never seen me look like that. Uh, what was the word, Buckley, you used? And then I was flabbergasted. I was flabbergasted. You used the word flabbergasted. Well, I, I tell you, this is like the biggest Christmas present early ever because I just admire true independence. And I got to tell you, Matt, and you know this with your crew, and Congress knows this, we wouldn't have won some of these gun battles, some of these uh, border battles, some of these energy battles, and we've lost some too, but we would have lost so many of them if it wasn't for the focal point. And even the White House and the Democrats admit, because I know you're saying you're nonpartisan. I mean, I would guess you're more of a libertarian. Correct me if I'm wrong. You're just a freedom guy. I can't be controlled. I cannot be controlled. There are no interests here but what I see as the world events, period. That is the truth of the situation. Well, they hate the fact that they can't control the agenda. Knockout is back. If you want a product that has 10 known ingredients that naturally get your body to relax, your brain to relax, so you get deep, restful sleep, knockouts it. Infowarslife.com. L-theanine, hops flower extract, lemon balm extract, valerian root extract, chamomile flower extract, L-tryptophan extract, melatonin, and more. All organic, all the natural sources. It's the same price as leading brands of melatonin that are three milligrams a piece. It has three milligram, the standard recommended dose for an adult. It's got the GABA. So it would probably cost $50 to take all this as separate pills. It's $19.95. You take one or two of these, and it just is really clean, restful sleep is what the reviews are. It's what I've experienced. 
and it just synergistically puts everything in there. InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Or call 888-253-3139. You are watching the InfoWars Nightly News, which airs 7 p.m. Central at InfoWarsNews.com. And your support is helping us defend liberty worldwide.